got the Alesis SR18 high-definition stereo multi-sample drum machine all hooked up and it came with its own nice little power supply and I bought separately a couple of Yamaha foot pedals for the start stop and the other one is for the fill it has this huge number of presets of all kinds and I've got it all hooked up. I'm going to try it out. It's got it set on the first one. We'll see how it goes. Well, that's good. Let's try the fill. Seems like at the end of the measure is when you get the fill. That's okay. There's a pretty fat book of instructions that comes with it, which I've not looked into, but I think I'll try another one of these. It's got more features and capabilities than I'm capable of. For now, anyway, it's going to be a slow situation for me. There's country 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. 79 through 83. Let's see if the fill button on the front still, or the mute. Oh, no, that's for something else. Stop. Oh, yeah, that still works. Or, so, when the foot, foot pedal's plugged in, you still use the buttons on the front. So, I'm going to go to 79. There is a... There we go. There are a number of buttons here. I'm sure you could just punch it in. I just choose to use the little rotor there. So, let's check this out. Also has bass. I did read a little bit. You can hit the mute button. Somewhere there's a... Oh, there's, there's a bass button right there. Hit the mute in the bass. Kills your bass. Now I'm assuming... That bass might be able to be programmed along with whatever song you're going to play. But for now, I'll mute it. It's got a separate volume on the back. Pretty darn nice. I've kind of shifted into mainly being a country player. I like old-timey country songs, folk songs, that sort of thing. This thing is really going to work good for me, I do believe. It's just got so many capabilities. I highly recommend it. Unless you're really technology challenged, I'm not too bad. So there we go. Just a little beginner session. We'll see where it goes from here.